Good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you are. Today's video, I've got a few updates for you, but the main one is going to be about multiple brand kits on Canva. Yep, yeah, it's finally here, multiple brand kits on Canva. So let's dive into Canva and have a look. For those of you that are new here, my name's Darren Meredith, and on this channel, we do all things Canva related. I'm a Canva certified creative, and I'm also a Canva creator, which means I create templates directly on Canva, and you can use them if you've got a pro account. So let's dive into Canva and have a look. The first update I've got is if you're not following me, on canva then you can do you can just come to canva.com forward slash p forward slash better content creators i'll put a link down below in the description to this profile but you can see all, all the profile images or all the templates that i've created are all here on my profile and you can use any of these you just click on them and you can then use them update them change them however you want to but yeah that's how you can follow me on Canva. That's the first update I've got for you today. These are all the templates that I've got currently in the queue waiting review. So do follow me when they come out, you'll be the first to be notified. The next update I've got is brand kits. Now, if you're not aware of brand kits, if you've got a pro account, you can have multiple brand kits now, which is fantastic. It's if you're a social media manager or you're someone that looks after multiple brands on a daily basis having multiple brand kits is gonna save you so much time so let's have a look at how you can get set up these multiple brand kits all you do is you come to the home page you come down to brand kits and you can see here i've got a few different brand kits where i've set up and i've started playing about with these it used to be when you clicked on brand kits that you'd just have one kind of look you'd be able to set up different color palettes on there but you'd only be able to set up one kind of set of brand fonts that you'd have to use across all your brands or if one of your brands had different multiple fonts then or different fonts for different brands then you'd have to go in and remember which fonts that they were using and the only way around it was that you'd have to upgrade to the enterprise version of Canva. However, multiple brand kits is now available or currently being rolled out. If you look and you don't see multiple brand kits or some of these features, it's because it's been rolled out at the moment. This is an early look at those, but we have been given the green light to be able to share this with you. So multiple brand kits, as I say, what you do is you come over, come to home, click on brand kits, and that'll take you to this page. All you do now is you can just add a brand kit, give your brand kit a name and then click on create. When you click on create, you'll be taken to a blank page. I've not set this up yet for better content creators, which is one of my brands. I can add in here brand logos and I can come in and I can choose brand logos. I can add the color palettes so I can add all the hex codes to this color palette. If I don't want that one i'm updating my brand at the moment i've not decided whether i'm going to have a particular brand logo and i'm thinking about updating the brand colors and also choosing some new fonts to make it look a little bit more funky up to date more stylistic and i'm going to be updating my website this year as well um, or this month should i say definitely going to be this year but I'm just currently in the process of updating my website so I'm just deciding on all this side of things how do you access this then so let's have a look once we are in a template so let's going to have a look I'm going to have a look at one of my designs so I'm just going to open up this design it's just a des design that I've just submitted for review at the moment so when you've got your template open or your design open and you're selecting colors it's very similar but when you come up to the color swatch up here you'll see now there's a little drop down has appeared and this is where you can swap between different brand or diff yeah different brand kits so all we're going to do is we're going to click on the name there or click on my name there and i can then switch to my color palette ideas now i've only added one of my color palettes to my color palette ideas at the moment but you can see as i add other different color palettes within that one brand kit it would all show up here similar to how i have currently set up because oops where i had darren meredith beforehand as my one brand i had all my different color palettes under there so i had my eyes of adventure and i had all my different color palette ideas and things like that all just under here but we'll see now it's going to be so much easier to just apply a color palette 
to a design. So if I want to come over and I can see I've got this color palette here, I can then choose from this. So if I want to apply my color palette to this design, I can could do, I could just apply those. Um, I can change the text color if I wanted the text color. So I could just make it to include more of my brand colors on there. The other option, obviously, as you're all probably aware of, is that you have under the styles option, you can come over and just click on the styles. But that's multiple brand kits, really easy to set up, going to save you a whole bunch of time so you're not switching or trying to figure out what the fonts are for your brand kits. That's what's showing up at the moment. It's been rolled out. One last thing I want to say is if you're following myself or you want to follow any other creators, if you want to see our templates, you can come to our profiles. All you do is you come to the templates option here from the home page. And then from within the home page, all you do is you can see creators that you follow. And I'm going to pick someone here for another creator for you to follow. Um, uh, let's not go too far. Let's go for this one. How to support a small business for free really like this post really clean modern design it just gives you some ideas of how you can share posts to help a small business which reminds me don't forget to click like and subscribe down below um, but let's have a look at who this post is by so if i just click on these three dots i can preview this template ah, it's by my fellow canvas certified creative sandy um, so if you just come over i'll put a link down below to her profile as well she's got some really nice designs on here got way more followers than me but don't forget to follow myself on camera as well i'm going to put all the links down below and also links to a competition that i'm running over on my facebook group if you're not a member of my facebook group it's just called better content creators i'll put a link down below of how you can join that how you can enter the competition which is basically going to be to Use one of my designs, follow me on social media and then tag me on that social media to let me know that you've used one of my designs. I'm going to then enter you into a competition to win a print of one of my favourite locations where I was travelling a couple of years ago. And that's going to be an A4 print. I'm going to post that out to you. So if you want to enter that competition, details down below, all the links down below. Thank you very much for joining and until next time, bye for now.